In this video, I'm going to be showing you top 5 US code secrets, which a lot of developers don't already know. So the first one in my list is a developer tool and you just have to write a developer and then tools. Okay, so once you do that, I want you to just hit enter. And now you have the basic knowledge of HTML and CSS. So now VS Code is totally yours. You can do anything you want to do right now. You can increase the fonts, you can change the colors, you can do whatever you want to do. So now let me just show you that. So I'm going to just select uh, this element right here. And I'm going to just change the color of that to like blue or maybe teal. So I'm going to just write like teal. And now if I hit enter, and here you can see all of these elements color is now set to teal and let me just try out for these one right here okay so now let me just select there and now let me just change the color of that to like crimson or something so i'm going to just write like crimson and let me just hit enter and this is how we can change the colors we can increase the font we can disappear something we can even provide animation if we wanted to we can do crazy amount of stuff so that was the first one now let me just close there and i'm going to also close this file right here and now the next one in my list is a toggle screencast mode so i'm going to open my command palette one more time so i'm going to just hit f1 and now let me type toggle screencast mode and as soon as i hit enter it's gonna toggle my screencast modes so now if i use any shortcut so it's gonna show us the preview of that shortcut right here on the screen okay so if i just use like the left arrow or if i use a down arrow if i want to go to the top of the file if i want to go to the bottom of the file it will now show us all of their shortcuts which you can see right here it's gonna show us all of their shortcuts right here Okay, so you know what, I'm going to just delete something like maybe update movie and here you can see it's going to show us all of their shortcuts which you can see right here on the screen. Now let me just hit Control Z, Control Z and yeah, that was the next one. Now the third one which I want to show you is that you just have to drag your file to anywhere and it's going to open that file in the separate window if I can grab that today and here you can see it's going to open this file totally separately. Okay, so as soon as I close this file and here you can see it's going to attach it right here back. Okay, so that was the third one. Now let me just show you the fourth one. So I want you to open your command palette one more time by hitting F1. And you just have to remove this greater than symbol and replace that with this end symbol right here. And here you can see I have all of the method which I currently have inside my file. So I can go to any method or property very quickly. So let's suppose if I want to go to like, I don't know, maybe update something so update movie and if i hit enter and here you can see it's going to bring us right here to the update movie i no longer have to search for a specific method or a function i can just open my command palette and i can totally search that for all of that specific method okay so that was the fourth one now the final one we have is something called the zen mode so i want you to just hold control and then hit k and then finally you have to write z and I know a lot of people will ask me like, Hussein, how did you do that? So now let me just open my toggle screen case mode one more time. And I'm going to just hold control, then hit K and then hit Z. Okay, so as soon as I do that, so it's going to open your Zen mode and it's going to remove all of the distraction. And now you can totally focus on your core. So now if you want to go outside from this Zen mode, so you just have to hit escape key twice. And here you can see now you're out from the Zen mode. And by the way, if you're wondering like which kind of theme I'm using, so I have a complete video on this. You can totally check it out on my channel.